This is a story from a friend of mine from college. All right, here we go. Three guys in one day. Not as bad as three different people in the same day. I was with three different people. I was with three different people in the same day. That was bad. I was going home for the summer. It's the end of the semester. You have to move out of your dorm. I had to say bye to people and everybody wanted to have sex. And I was like, and and I said, why didn't I just say no? (laughs) Okay. I was like, well, thank you for holding on to me and my stuff for the summer. Then he was like, well, oh my God. And he was like, well, oh my God. Then the person who dropped me off wanted to say bye. Then the person I was dating wanted to say bye. Oh, so, okay. So uh, (laughs) bye means sex. Okay. Yeah. Whoa. Go ahead, girl. (laughs) No, I didn't want to. I needed to say no. I didn't want to. I just felt like. Well, do you feel okay? Like in hindsight? Yeah, I feel okay in hindsight. It was, it was more like it's too much. I did not want to. That's too many people. Three separate people in one day within 16 hours, morning to night. They were all shaking each other's hands and they didn't know. None of them knew. (laughs) In the morning, the guy picks me up to take me to my ex's house where my stuff is stored. He's like, oh, yeah, man. Thank you for holding on to my girl's stuff. (laughs) No, no. I'm trying to think who was the third person. I don't even remember who all the people were. All I remember is my boyfriend freshman year. You can't keep your stuff in the... (laughs) All I remember is my boyfriend freshman year. You can't keep your stuff in the dorm over the summer, but I'm not flying back home across the country. So I had to keep it in someone's place or apartment. So he was holding on to my stuff all year. And I was like, I'll get it whenever. And then I was talking to this other guy who found out who I found out had a girlfriend. So I said, I'm done with this, but I still need your car. I still need you to drive me, uh, drive me around and stuff. (laughs) And then I was dating someone. And then I was dating someone. Yes. Wow. Okay. So I think the person I was dating, I probably had sex with that morning. Makes sense. The car guy, we had sex. It's like, oh, goodbye. You're leaving me. I'm not going to see you all summer. I don't even know where we did it. Honestly, probably the car. Probably the car. And then he drives me to this. And then he drives me to this other guy's house who's holding my stuff. My ex's house. It just feels weird watching them shake each other's hands, dapping each other up, but none of them knew. At least I don't think any of them knew. Wow. Obsessed. <laughs> okay, we had the guy, we had car guy, we had ex, and we had current date. Current boyfriend. Current boyfriend. Uh-huh. All uh, because all because she had to go home for the summer. It's saying goodbye. Like I, I like I said, I, I don't it, saying goodbye is hard. <laughs> so saying goodbye is hard. <laughs> 